You know what's more stressful than paranoia? Being a YouTube creator! What's up everybody? Apparently I hit this four minutes ago and we never actually started. We hello beep beeps. All the beeps. Ugh. Hey, Amana! Wait, hey, hey, why is Amana dressed like that <laughs> anyway? The frilly goth dress? I love it. But I can't see her juice in it. It's gothic Lolita, right? Oh, that's, let's see, uh, Kensuke. Do you know how a ninja gets superhuman jumping abilities? Ninjas? Uh, no, not a clue. First, they plant a sapling in their yard, just a little one, maybe five centimeters high, and a young child can jump over it. The young ninja jumps over the sapling over and over, day in and day out, over and over and over again. Uh, <laughs> Is this going to take a long... But the sapling grows bigger, day by day. Uh, the change is so small, it isn't noticed, but the ninja still jumps it. Ah, I see. Okay, but I was asking about me use. You look like you're caught on a new, uh, uh, you've caught on a newcomer. That's right, the ninja's able to jump the full-grown tree eventually. That's impossible! And what does that have to do about the lolly goth outfit anyway? Miu's been working here since she was little, right? She was in grade school on her first day. We told her it was the cafe uniform and made her wear it. Miu didn't dare say anything about it. In fact, she was happy to wear it because it meant she was able to help run the family business. And my only job was to adjust the dress as Miu grew up. <laughs> That's it. I still don't know where you're going with the ninja story, <laughs> but I'm impressed. That's all I gotta say. Right. It was a long journey, but now we're reaping the rewards. Oh man, you sneaky devil! <laughs> yes, a uh, little, little bit perverse. Do you know, do either of you know just how much a creeps you both sound? Yes, yes I do. That's not very nice, Mikes. I'm not the only one enjoying Mew's business attire. Uh, I don't like the way you said business. Ugh. That ain't business attire! You totally missed the joke there, Miami. <laughs> yeah, right. Me, Umana, in that dress, Flitting. flitting about like a bumblebee. Would a man would take a second look, or even a third? I might as well stare so hard it bores a hole through that dress. Right, new guy. You know his name is Protag. Why do you right, keep right. calling him new guy? Right. It's not even like a voice thing. You can just write it in there, huh? Me. Yeah, how about it? Are you enjoying Miu's outfit? Uh, are they are they actually gonna give me a choice? Oh my god! Um, this is I, I guarantee this is a pivotal moment. So the thing is, like, okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna voice this out because I want I like Miu. Go. For it. But I'm not really into the goth Lolita look, so that's the hard part. I do not want to see it on this one, but oh, of course but I feel did. like if I say I'm not interested, it's gonna ruin. The chances. So, so you're eliminating Mimi right now. Right? No, I don't want Mimi. Okay, well, Mimi is off she's the table. A, she's a pain in my ass. <laughs> um, you don't like the bossy like Yandere? I'm fine with I'm fine with bossy. She's just a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> like straight up out the first out the gate. So, I don't care about you, anyways. But your cooking is great. Yeah, you can clean my house. Uh, why are you hanging out with people? I don't care what you do, but uh, make sure you make me dinner. Don't hang out with the wrong people. Don't embarrass me. House. Like, yeah, okay. like right, F this so. woman. So I'm going to go with I guess so, but I do not like the goth Lolita look. Because I think it's going to help. What? I didn't see you in Cadre. Everyone's surprised. Cult. But now I know. I'm getting a lock on my bedroom door. <laughs> That's a big misunderstanding, Mikes. This is simply a healthy physiological response. For from he from healthy males that from threw me off. I don't care. I know simple word. Yeah, <laughs> I I mean I don't care what you think either. Well, hello everyone. It's nice to see you all gathered here. Uh, Sayaka Mashiro, what's a princess like you doing in an, in a hole in the cafe? Yeah. Hole in the wall cafe. I, like okay, this. okay. Let me just stop right there. The reason I screwed that one up is because I read it as what are you doing in this a hole, and I'm like that is not. What nope. the words say. <laughs> Watch your mouth, Kensuke. Okay, I could have said it anyways. 
Oh, I too have the right to enjoy the life of, a com of the common man. Well, some of us don't have a choice but to enjoy the common man's life. Uh, you enjoy it a little bit, but Please don't take it personally, lady. Mind me. What, what, what is our tip? A pan-fried snack cake with a butterfly flavor that Saya loves. The Kamishiro dough spins on this Middle Ages era confection. Why? What? Okay, so... It's just telling, a, telling me what to buy her, I guess. This has to be like, if you want to impress Saya, get her one of these cakes, like... It's gotta be. Please don't, don't take know, it we're person her. personally, Lady Maimi. Uh, Carson, one cup of Imperial Earl Grey with a, with a financier accompaniment? What? Accompaniment. Right, but what is a finance here? I'm thinking just like finances. Uh, could you order something off the menu, please? What's gotten into you, Sila? The last time I took you here, you stormed out because I didn't have moist towelettes. We do have moist towelettes now. <laughs> I got thirsty on the way home. On the way home, uh, from location scouting, this place caught my eye, so I had Hatori pull up the car. I see. So that black car is yours. That's a huge car! It looks so out of place in town! Anyway, Garçon, one cup of your finest red tea then. May I take this seat at the counter? I read that as Garcon! Garcon, I, I, I know, but it's pronounced You Garçon. did it right though! Did you yeah. say you were location scouting? I knew you were involved in that movie! It, it was not hidden. Now that we've announced it, I suppose I can say Kamashiro Do is leading the production. That's a pretty dress, Mia. Quotations. Ellipsis. Really? Question mark? Quotations. The official announcement was made the other day at Kamashiro Hotel. I'd like to know how you're involved, Saya. I'm, I'm sleeping with the talent. Uh, why, why should my involvement with the film make any difference to you? Isn't it obvious? I want you to help me meet Nika. I've been a fan since Let's Settle the Score debuted. Oh, Jesus. What's this too? Uh, ZZ Panda debut song. I don't care. <laughs> okay. It's ZZ Panda. I don't, I, don't, I don't care about Ray, unfortunately. I'm only helping out a little. My brother's handling the majority of the production. What? So Nika and Mibu really are? Are what? Ignore him, Sila. He's just going crazy over Nika. Well, listen, Asagi. I don't recommend meeting anyone you're, uh, anyone you're a big fan of. Huh? Why not? Idols are idols. They work hard to satisfy their fans through the camera lens. Oh, sounds erotic. <laughs> Sila, don't twist my words around. Nothing good comes from meeting your heroes in real life, you know. For example, seeing them in the bathroom. Nika never goes to the bathroom. Oh my god, really? Yeah, Ken thinks that. Or seeing them blow their nose. Nika's body doesn't produce snot. Dude, seriously. <laughs> or releasing gas after eating baked potatoes. Nika's body doesn't release gas! Yeah, <laughs> listen <laughs> Nope. Quotations, ellipsis. Toad. Period. Quotations. I didn't know that was like a goth Lolita dress. That just yeah. looks like a maid outfit. Yeah, yeah it's yeah, goth Lolita. Welcome! A tall young man walks in wearing a uh, Mihate high school uniform. The girl sitting in the back gasps for a moment. He turns his relaxed eyes in our direction. Then he puts on a brisk smile and waves at us. Who's he waving at? Ho! Mimey? Male student A. Was, was male student A the... Who, who had male? I don't know. That was you, but was I don't know me? what you had. Was, uh, <laughs> you have fun reading your scribble chicken. I will. No, I have female student A. Yeah, but you also have male. Oh, okay. Hey, Saga, Yab Saga Mia! We're over here. The guy, Saga Mia, Sagi Mia, turns around at the voice and joins a group of guys at the table in the back. Are you introducing another fucking character? God damn. Yup. Is he a friend of yours, Mimi? Hmm, well, I guess you could sell that. I blew him in the alley available. Who is he? Hey, mind your own beeswax! Uh, alright. That's Saga Mia! 
He's a year above us and the captain of the soccer team. I don't know why, but that ugly chump's actually popular with the girls. Isn't that right, mommy? Whatever. You see why she's not an option to me? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I guess even somebody like Sagamia comes to the mom and pop cafe. Kensuke, don't call it a mom and pop cafe. Our establishment has a proper name. Mio Cafe. <laughs> Quotations. Hey, period. Quotations. Thank you, Miu, for being the best voice in the entire game. It's the easiest voice to do. It's just soft, and you just say, like, a couple things. <laughs> I, I'm actually adding dialogue to Miu by adding those, like... Oh, yeah, absolutely. You have to, otherwise it would just be, hey, disappear. <laughs> Turd, disappear. Coffee, disappear. Like, what the f... <laughs> Pig, disappear. Right. Really? It will be sunny on the weekend? Will it be sunny? Yeah, apparently the rain season comes and goes. Wait, what the hell are you doing here anyway? Let's do our best to ignore to ignore Isagi. There's no other way around it. Fine, uh, anyway, we'll have Mystery Club Barbecue coming Sunday. Whoa, nice deets, please. You still expect me to ignore this? I'm not that patient. I'm not patient at all. <gasps> you must you must not be defeated. Train your intent in insensitivity. Insensitivity. That is a quote from a famous author. Though it is intent its intent is to Hey Saya, are you finished yet? I wanna know about the barbecue already. Literally she was talking. Yeah. <laughs> be a little considerate, you coal you insensitive clod. She reminds me of Peridot from uh, Steven Universe. Yeah. Claude. Yeah, Claude. Look who's talking. Why are we having a barbecue? It seems a little out of season for it. Hmm, well, true, but we haven't had any groups out meetings outside the Mystery Club started back in April. So many bad words. Now that we have another member, I feel like now is a good time. We might not get another chance because it is a rainy night. Lady Baimi, Miss Yamashiro hasn't shown up yet. Are you sure you want to proceed with the club meeting? Oh, Miss Yamashiro isn't going to make it. She said she, a freshman's gone missing since last night, and we should go on. And you know what? We will go on next time! Yeah, we should continue to have our club while people have just disappeared. Yeah, just children abduction. Yeah, no, it's club meeting. Scooby-Doo inbound. Right. <laughs> Newest video above! Nope, going to sleep. No, you're supposed to tell them like no, and subscribe. Nope, going to sleep. No, like and subscribe. No, going to sleep. Oh, <sighs> like and subscribe. Go to sleep. Like and subscribe. Going to sleep.